How's everybody doing? Uh, we've had a heck of a summer. I want to thank everybody, though, for sticking with us this summer and working hard. And I know a lot of you gave up your vacations and we worked online. We worked together. Now we're back in the studio at social distancing. And I do really appreciate and want to thank everybody for just hanging in there and dealing with it. And uh, it actually, in some ways, has been kind of exciting doing different recitals and different venues. Uh, I want to thank actors. Uh, Stan Raby and Sirica, Mr. Zach, and Lucas and uh, Dallas for running our sets, our lighting and sound for us. It uh, came off very well, and since I wasn't able to be to a lot of the events uh, due to the dangers at my age, Kimberly Kellen ran the shows and did a great job. I want to thank everybody very much for all the things that they've done uh, this summer. And the final piece of uh, last year's events will be coming forward in, uh, in the end of August. August 30th, we'll be doing two shows in C.Y. Stevens. We'd like, you know, why don't you come on down and take a look and sit in a nice relaxing chair. There are plenty of spaces. There's a lot of space for distancing and you can uh, sit in the cool air conditioning and enjoy, you know, the last two big events of uh, last season. And then we'll have a whole week off. Our summer will be a week long at the studio and we'll start up again uh, uh, September 8th uh, with new classes. And immediately following that, we'll have our auditions for, uh, since the Nutcracker unfortunately had to be canceled, we'll be having auditions for our holiday show. The show will be uh, the same weekend that we normally do the Nutcracker, probably at City Hall Auditorium, just because we want to keep the costs low. We'll, be funding this ourselves. We're looking for some sponsorships, but we'll be funding this ourselves so the, the dancers do have something to do over the holidays uh, like they have in, for the last 40 years, really, with a Nutcracker. So we're, we got a lot of things planned. We're not dead over here. You can still take class via Zoom if you want to, if you're still concerned, and a lot of us still are, justifiably so. Uh, we'll have to see what things happen, how things go when the students come back if there's another uptick but hopefully maybe it might just eventually you know run its course uh, I don't know uh, nobody knows really but we're prepared for anything and we'd love to work with you and we want to thank you for being with us Dance Center Dancer is going to be up and running Iowa Youth Ballet is going to be up and running we're still ticking away here uh, don't forget about us and again thank you very much from the bottom of my, of my heart I'm Robert Thomas. I'm the owner of the dance studio along with my wife, Miyoko. And uh, we're very grateful for your patronage and for how you've stuck by us throughout the years, really, and especially this summer when we, we weren't sure if we were going to make it. A lot of the studios were closing. Once you close, you know, you never really know when you'd be able to reopen. Uh, you can see that with the schools where they're not sure yet. And I don't think we could have uh, sustained a full year without without paying people and working so thank you you've kept us afloat and we appreciate you we very much appreciate you